Hello, this is Joyce Not a Spring Chick Chow. We are here at SEMA Road. Yeah, we just came from the SEMA show. And we wanted to show you something you typically do not see, and that is rain in the desert. Yeah, can you believe that? Rain in the desert. Well, for now, I guess there is important news. We're going to bring all the camera on with comments on the headlines of today. And, of course, oh, wait, the big news is today's the last day of the SEMA show. Today's the last day of the SEMA <laughs> show, and I get to come in out of the rain. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Berlusconi urged to quit his bond yields climb. Well, yeah, and uh, don't worry, folks, that the uh, uh, our unemployment rate went down today amazingly as the market is going down, as the as the world is in a stage of collapse. You know, they're going to throw governments out all over the world because the people you can't. Okay, they're, they're, there's one thing about cutting services, there's another thing about raising taxes. There is no money. You can't raise taxes on people that aren't working. An Obama swing state cash problem. Yeah, because they don't want to contribute to him anymore. They, they, he's basically caught single-handedly continuing. The, if he'd have left well enough alone, everything would have been over by now. The whole world knows it. And they blame the United States and Obama for keeping this problem going. And Boeing leasing shuttle hangar to build new capsule. Yeah, they're basically going to go back up whether Obama likes it or not. Because Obama, do, okay, Muslims don't believe in space travel. Obama doesn't believe in space travel. The only thing he wants NASA for is an outreach to the Muslims. And three, do I know, isn't that, NASA does not stand for Muslim outreach. But that's what he wants it to be, though. And uh, three Dodgers and three Red Sox earned golden, or gold glove honors. I know, isn't that something? Two teams that stunk won golden gloves. That, that doesn't happen that Golden often. gloves or golden gold glove, gloves? Golden gloves. <laughs> And Greek PM wins cabinet backing for referendum. No, but the, now, but they've decided against the referendum because the people are going to vote against giving, uh, kind of giving in to the European Union. So what's going to? It's just really ridiculous. They're going, they're they're going to give the Europeans what the Europeans want in return. The Greek government's going to collapse, which is exactly what they're trying to prevent from happening. And the Greek worry revised risk aversion and fed in focus. Well, yeah. <laughs> It, it, it's just it, it, you can't avert the inevitable. They they fell they they have fought, fell to six times. They're going to fall to seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. They don't have any money. And MF Global accounts shock leaves clients scrambling. Well, because they're the people invested in these bonds that um, MF Global was selling for other countries, and then the other countries using all the countries are using the Obama doctrine, which says bonds aren't worth the paper they're written on. So nobody will invest in them anymore. And Greek Prime Minister faces knife edge survival vote. Well, he's not going to, they said he may get the vote, but he'll lose his, he'll lose his job. So what, that's ridiculous. You keep your job by not raising taxes. You lose your job by raising taxes. So what's the intelligent thing to do? And U.S. takes a hard line on Chinese economic cyber spying. Yeah, what are they going to do about it? Because they produce all the equipment that we use in our homes and everything. Are you serious? Yeah. And Van Shoes co-founder James Vanderen dies at 72. I know. I mean, that's not as bad as... I mean, he's I mean, got a 72. One, here's the good... The Cardinal that threw the, the baseball out for the seventh game of the World Series died this day while, you know, getting ready for the next season for the team. So, and that's something. The third most active... Third greatest winner in Cardinal history... And the only cardinal ever to pitch multiple no hitters dies a week to the day he threw out the pitch for the seventh game of the World Series, which they won. And pen pals from Vietnam War meet 45 years later. Yeah, and that's not usual. That happens. Generally, one of the others dead by that time. And Groupon says IPO share price available Friday. Things to know. Yeah, they got they made seven hundred million dollars on a sale. Nobody understands how the company doesn't make a profit and they cook the books. That's generally criminal misconduct. Oh, and Oakland cleans up after Occupy protests turned violent. Yeah, basically the police acted. The the mayor of the city they're wanting to throw the female left wing mayor of the city out because there was it, it wouldn't have happened if she'd have let the police do their job. They shut down a port which cost uh, tens of millions of dollars and cost a lot of people a lot of uh, working time because they're not working. They still haven't got it back in full function yet because of what she allowed to happen. I'm surprised you didn't, well, she should have let the police do their job. No, but she's a left-wing liberal. She said, I, I'm with those 99% of the people that hate Wall Street. No, 99% of the people don't hate Wall Street because Wall Street is Main Street, folks. I think she was kind of encouraging them. What do you think? She's a liberal, she's a left-wing Democrat. 
An Olympus panel aims to hear ex-CEO need at least a month. Yeah, but uh, the, the problem is the Olympic Games are in as big a trouble as anything else because England, no one can afford to go to the next Olympic Games and England is massively in debt. Was and that the Olympics or Olympic. Olympus like it's the Olympic No, camera. Olympic. Oh, okay. So, but they're, they're, England can't finish what they're doing because they don't have the money to finish the buildings. And serious, oh, that's bad. Yeah, it's just coming up next summer. Already? Yeah, 212. Oh. Siri says, uh, reaches deal with Arab League on unrest. Yeah, basically, you, you you don't screw with us, and we're not going to let things spread any further than our borders. And under pressure, Bank of America drops $5 debit card fee. Well, because the government owns Bank of America. I mean, how do they think they were going to do that with the government owning the company? So, Avon's cram gave city bribery probe info source. Yeah, and that's something. <laughs> you think that every... I mean, our, our mo okay, our most democratically ran business is crooked. Ah, gee. Let's try to think of ones that aren't. And Fed to hold steady despite global risk. Well, yeah, because there's nothing else they can do. They, they to go to, The Federal Reserve yesterday said that unemployment is only going to go up on the day Obama's unemployment figures went down. The, they're basically, they're working across purposes again, aren't they? Oh, it sure sounds like it. And volatile Oakland faces general strike on Wednesday. Yeah, because they're going to try to shut them down again. Again? Yep. They tried to shut down Las Vegas, and the basically the police were the police shut down half of the karate parking in in parking garages to try to keep them from getting into the garages. And a Dodgers MLB agree to sell the team, or LA Dodgers. Do Dodgers Major League Baseball, yeah, because uh, that basically that they he was in a no-win situation because. That he could basically, he'll win the lawsuit when it's all sold. And then basically Major League Baseball is going to suffer greatly for, uh, just because what it is, McCourt's a Republican and the other people are all Democrats. Isn't that amazing mm -hmm. how that works out? An accused Tucson shooter seeks end to medication. Because they can't do that. They're trying to medicate, they're trying to, uh, in order, to, uh, Supreme Court will throw it out. They're giving him drugs to try to make him look like he can, uh, is sane enough to have a trial. You can't do that. Basically, you have a right to refuse medicine in this country, and in the in Arizona's own state laws, say the patient cannot, the patients, um, uh, either the patient or their guardians, his parents or his guardians, his parents have said no medicine because he's insane and you're just trying to kill him. And Marilyn Killer facing death penalty he says murder haunts him. Not really. I mean, they sat there and raped a bunch of people then tied them in a bed and poured gasoline on them and set them on fire. Are you serious? Yeah, there was premeditated, you know, torture. And Obama makes former slave haven a national monument. Isn't that amazing uh, how Obama would do something like that? The first black president makes a, an era, tries to rub white people's faces in something. It's, yeah. it basically, it's another one of his... He's outreaching to the left of his party, and the left doesn't want him to run. And future holds more extreme weather. Yeah, we're, it's in a, we're in the middle of the desert, folks, and it's raining on us. You can hear it hitting our umbrella. I know. And police, Beaver sexual tourism may be investigated. Well, yeah, because the woman, basically, Beaver, okay, it, 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 Justin Beaver was underage when he was fooling around, so basically the woman can't get any money because he's not responsible and they could call it they could basically turn around and say that he was attacked by her now that was stupidity on the part of that woman and ex-giant Maddie Alou died 72 dies in the Dominican Republic I know he's the first of the Lou brothers to die I mean all of them were great hitters I mean we're talking he said almost 6,000 hits between the three brothers and nobody's ever got that time of hits in baseball history oh and news about Iraq is lost in the fog of chatter and gossip well, because uh, nobody's paying any attention to Iraq anymore, because Obama's ending the war. He's pulling all the troops out of there, and then uh, by this time next year, everyone will be going out of Afghanistan, and then we'll get ready to start war all over again in 2013. And the occupier's choice, violence or failure? It's violence, because everybody knew, okay, the left always goes to violence. They went to violence in the 60s. They, every time that they have formed one of these organ groups, they go to violence, and they, I love it. Well, we're not doing anything that the Tea Party didn't do, and, and they didn't get punished like we did. And a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. If your low expectations are always met, does that mean that they are set too low? 